All right. Good morning. This is Luke Thomas Holmquist here at the Earthquake Forecast Center, QuakePrediction.com. It's 10.07 in the morning on Monday, April 8th, 2024. The eclipse of the sun is coming pretty soon. Let's get to the uh, forecast here for San Francisco Bay. First of all, we had a, uh, a warning out in our last uh, previous video, a couple of videos back, for a strong earthquake in the San Francisco Bay. And uh, what happened was a 4.8, 4.8 and 4.5 earthquake hit in uh, north of San Francisco Bay. Now, uh, then we had the high risk here uh, in the San Francisco Bay on the 5th into the 6th, and that produced a 3.4 there near Berkeley. And this is the forecast map for today, August 8th into the 9th. Uh, pretty high risk here, 90% in the San Francisco Bay, extending over to Mammoth Lakes and down to Coalinga Parkfield. Highest risk is up here near South Lake Tahoe in uh, and uh, Reno, Nevada, in Northeast California and Northwest Nevada. That's where the highest risk is today into tomorrow. Of course, we have high risk down here in San Francisco Bay as well. 3.4 earthquake just hit right there, just north of San Francisco Bay. And that just happened just a few minutes ago. Uh, and now this is the serious situation for August, August, April 10th, April 10th into the 11th. April 10th into the 11th, we're looking for a very strong 5.5, uh, 6.5 earthquake in the San Francisco Bay. Right now, it looks most likely in the 11th of April, but this map here is for April 10th. So either 10th or the 11th, or maybe late on the 10th into the 11th, looking for a very strong 5.5 to 6.5 right there in the San Francisco Bay. I haven't seen something like this for a very, very long time. And uh, so the risk is extremely high right now. And this is a dangerous situation. That's why I wanted to make a video and personally tell you that you need to prepare for this earthquake. Um, I haven't seen something like this for a very long time. Look at this uh we had a forecast for very high risk in uh, the Iwate Prefecture of Japan in north, northern Japan, and uh, we were calling for a 5.0, 5.5 earthquake. You can see hit right in that area uh, at the scheduled time. So this forecast model is working very well. Um, you can check it out over at quakeprediction.com and... Uh, the forecast continues to improve. We are, uh, we've been forecasting really well over in Japan as well. So please take this into consideration. Very strong earthquake on April 10th, most likely late on April 10th into April 11th. Uh, looking for a very strong 5.5 to 6.5 earthquake. And I haven't seen this kind of situation in a very long time. The uh, magnetic field is very tangled in this area. And it's a serious situation. So looking for a strong earthquake in the San Francisco Bay, April 10th into April 11th. Thanks for stopping by, everybody. It's uh, Luke Thomas on the push to thequakeprediction.com. Uh, over 273,000 followers on quakeprediction.com, uh, the Twitter and social media. 19 years of research, many, many, many years of research and uh, we're getting closer and closer to uh, forecasting earthquakes at a very precise uh, way. And uh, now a strong earthquake coming up uh, April 10th, just in a couple of days, April 10th into April 11th. Very strong, 5.5 to 6.5. It could be much stronger, it could be a seven. But right now it looks like about 5.5 to 6.5. Strong earthquake in the San Francisco Bay. Please warn your friends and family. Uh, of this upcoming earthquake in the San Francisco Bay on April 10th or April 11th. And uh, we'll keep you informed here. We're going to be adding, adding uh, Italy and Greece to our forecasts here soon. Right now we have California and Japan. And uh, you can take a look at uh, the Japan for forecast by going to quakeprediction.com. Click on Japan and you can see the risk over there. But uh, thanks again and we will talk to you soon. And I'll talk to you after the earthquake, April 10th into 11th, very strong earthquake. Please uh, stay prepared for that. Thanks.